Okay, we just uh, got back in the car, ate our lunch. We're at a spot here where um, we saw what they call a bear jam. So we stopped to take a look and it turns out it was probably $3.99 and her cut and too far away to get some any really good pictures but there was a lot of people here taking pictures and they yeah. were moving around through the through the fields for a while so i'd say we watched them for a good 30 30 45 minutes yeah yeah, yeah. so at one point she um laid over in the snow and um the cub started nursing yeah which is um pretty wild because he's as big as she is yeah he's, almost, he's pretty yeah. big yeah yeah so and they're the only two that's traveling the park through the park together um so that's so why we're, we're pretty sure yeah. it was 399 yeah. so i watched through the binoculars for a while but yeah yeah so, so not bucket bad. list check off <laughs> <laughs> yeah so that's cool all right let's go jenny lake maybe we'll get a hike in today <laughs> All we want to do now is see a moose, which I'm not holding out much hope for. We saw that one from really far away, but I uh, haven't been hearing too many other stories about people seeing them this early. So let's go. Well, we're back out on a trail. I was just getting ready to do that. <laughs> <laughs> we're on uh, Jenny Lake Trail. It's about 12.30 in the afternoon, maybe a little bit later. We just uh, spent a couple of hours watching uh, probably $3.99 in her cup and uh, having lunch and I had to come over here and see how this trail was. It doesn't look so good. It's muddy and snowy. Yeah. So we probably won't go very far, but we are going to get out and get a little bit of exercise. Oh, oh, what was that? That's some kind of poop. Might be people poop though. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people have been doing this trail, it looks like, but there's still a lot of snow on it. I mean, this is really deep snow. It's packed down where people have been walking on it. But, but aside from the trail, it's a beautiful day and the scenery is just fantastic. I know, I'm getting ready to take my legs off. <laughs> Yeah. I'll be yeah. Shorts and yeah. Yeah. I probably could have put my shorts on. Yeah. Oh well. All right. Oh yeah. You're in jeans. You're great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think we're maybe a half a mile in. And we're getting our first glimpse of uh, Jenny Lake. Today, anyway, we, we drove by and stopped and looked. Not yet, was it yesterday or no, it was the first day. <laughs> <laughs> and there she is, Jenny Lake. There's actually less ice on, her, on it now than there was the other day, which is, I would think normal since it's gotten pretty warm. And uh, we've, we've decided we're gonna shoot for Hidden Falls. We've been talking to people that are on their way back and they're saying it's, it's manageable. There's 1.9 miles from a marker back there. Probably end up being about four and a half mile trip for us all together. So we're gonna try it. Four and a half miles isn't normally too much for us. This is a tough trail though. So, let's go. Oh, somebody banging on a rock over there or something.
Wow. <laughs> yeah. Um, just amazing. It's another amazing day. Yeah. Yeah. show you guys our view right now. We decided to play it smart. We did not go to Hidden Falls because when we left out, we were only gonna go maybe a mile. So we don't have a whole lot of water with us and to do five miles when we don't have very much water. And it's getting a little warm. It's not smart. So, we decided that we may come back and do this tomorrow when we're better prepared. But for right now, this is just gorgeous. Still a good hike. Yeah. Okay. This is about where we turned around yesterday, which was pretty smart because we were definitely not prepared. We were just about out of water by the time we got back, just from that little bit and still have at least a mile to go. And I'm not sure if that's to the trailhead or to the actual falls. So, but uh, I've moved along pretty good and now I'm gonna slow down a little bit, try to take it in. But uh, it's, uh, the trail was not too bad, it refroze. So it was pretty slushy yesterday, but it refroze last night. So still haven't seen anybody else on the trail. But there, there was quite a few cars in the parking lot. It's been a nice hike so far. Very peaceful. This is uh, probably one of the trees that we were warned about yesterday. I just went over another one over there. It was pretty easy to get around. But uh, yeah, this is a uh, thanks for the warning, but really compared to what we've already seen in the Smokies, this is nothing. <laughs> Surprises of not more trees down with the wind that they had, but okay, keep going. Let's take a look out here. That's nice, so peaceful. Possibly, this might be the water source for the. Hidden Falls, which I'm heading to. Maybe, maybe not. We'll find out. Here's the other down tree. Yeah, this one is a little difficult to get around, but you can see other people climbing up here and going around it. Pretty close to the boat dock, I think. Just past the sign for it. Okay, here we go. This one here was the hardest one to get around so far. These signs hidden by the tree fall, but I spotted it along with this one about bats. <laughs> Good advice. I don't think this is the falls, but 
it's pretty nice. Let's keep going. This trail is started to get a little difficult. It's a good climb and uh, some of these steps are covered in snow, so it makes it hard. Still not sure if this is it or not. Seems a little early, but uh, and I don't see any people or signs or anything, so let's keep going. made it to Hidden Falls. That's nice. It was a challenge though, so I'm sorry you missed it, Tanya, but this would have been tough. Okay, I just saw the falls and found the trail going up to Inspiration Point. This one seems a lot, a lot more clear right now. A bit of a climb. But according to the people I just spoke with, it was not that far up. I thought on the map it said it was another mile, but so far the distances have been off. So. We're in good shape. Oh, wow. This is nice. Let's take a look around. Awesome. Okay, let's go.
Must, must be like an assault on my walking stick right there at the handle. I guess, I don't know. But absolutely no fear. I can almost reach out and touch him. Boink! But I really don't feel like getting bit by a forest rat. Oh, there's another one. Hmm, oh, yelling at them. I don't think they're friends. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> you don't want to take turns. I don't think the other part of the stick is any good and it doesn't have any salt on it. Hmm. Okay, I'm all inspired and heading back down. And then already passed a couple of people. There's a couple more people on their way down that went into the canyon. So I am no longer alone. I can see some other people coming up the trail. I just saw them down here somewhere. Okay, right, let's go. up here. I saw the tracks on the trail. I had no idea where the heck it was going, but it was following the trail and here it is. I probably passed it on the way up and didn't even see it. Well he's just laid down so we're gonna we're gonna walk by. Because I got a ride to catch. Or at least I'm going to walk by. <laughs> I don't know if you got that or not, but he got up as I went by and gave me a little bit of a look. But... I bet he's gonna lay back down. Yeah, there he goes. Okay, anybody that wants to continue on. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> they're going, they're taking a wide route. You made it. <laughs> All right, my last look at the falls before I start working my way down. There's lots of people on the trail now. 
So I'm not alone. I'm not worried. I saw a moose. That was cool as hell. <laughs> and now uh, I wouldn't be surprised to see anything out here. Let's go. Well, that one brought me to my knee.